So what's this article going to say? We're going to uh, maintain them? Do I understand that we're going to maintain these sidewalks now on the west side? Am I right? Am I correct? What the article is asking, it is not stating that we're going to do anything. It's advisory only in nature, and it's asking for the input from the citizens of Hampton as to whether or not the Board of Selectmen can okay. take that on. I, would, I know there's a lot of people who were raised here, born here, and the whole works. And uh, I've already spoken on this before. And to speak on this and do it justice, I got to bring some history in. 1932, the town of Hampton voted not to give this land to the beach. I'd give it to the state. They turned it down. In 33, the state of New Hampshire came back and they re-voted. They said, look, we will take the beach. You give us the whole thing. We'll take care of you from this lot line right here, east. That included the sidewalk in the east and the sidewalk in the, the west. Now, the thing about it is that bothers me on this, one of the old timers in Hampton, Homer Johnson, said there'll be a day when they'll renege on this. They're going to try to get out of it. Now, I'm not saying the state's trying to get out of it. I'm just saying we should make four or five departments in the town of Hampton and say, well, transportation don't have that no more. Dread does it. But Hampton Beach Improvement owned where you people may be going down the beach and saw a green line. Did anybody see a green line a few years back painted on the sidewalk? How many of you saw that? All right. That's where the town... 99-year lease to the Hampton Beach Improvement. That was their project. Well, Bachelor himself and that group took care of some of the construction. Then it went on and Homer Johnson took it over. Well, Homer came to me one day and he says, jump in, we're gonna go up to Bachelor's. And we took it over from that day on. For me to be able to do anything, we took care of strictly the roads, not the sidewalks, not the sidewalks. We weren't allowed to touch a sidewalk up in the ocean front without their permission. And when we got their permission, the people paid for it. But if you notice, the A block had hot top up there. The rest of them had uh, concrete. Well, we took care of the Hampton Beach Improvement, and we had a problem one night, real bad problem, and Cronin was, I think, the state guy, and he was tough as nails. We had a, a drain pipe not working, and it ran down A Street and went in the club down the end, and there was a plug on the floor, and it blew the plug out. The people were sitting at that table, they were playing a game. I went up and I told them they have gotta fix that. Well, they didn't fix it, so what we did with the Hampton Beach Improvements permission, we went up and we put a hump up there on A Street. When the water come down, it ran down the ocean front. I think if you go down, it still runs down there. I don't think they change it because they had to fix the catch basin. Well, anyways, they had not do, they, had, they would not fix them. If you go up, keep going right up, they asked us, the town of Hampton back in the I don't know if you were on the board there, Mary Louise, they wanted to put a drain pipe over into uh, uh, the road going out, the, going out to Toby, the, what's it, Johnson, uh, the old place, on the ocean front, on North Shore. Place called? Yeah, place called, but it's a name for that road. They said, could we drain in there? Ancient Highway. Ancient Highway. Could we put a drain going over the Ancient Highway? Well, you know who owns that drain now, don't you? They dumped it right back on us. I, I got to tell you right now, you people have been talking about uh, money here. Do you realize what this is going to cost if we get caught and we have to maintain these? 
I mean, I don't know what they promised people, but uh, Patekoe State Park, they said they don't do any more sidewalks. May I ask the manager a question why I'm doing this? If it's on this. I, it's I on strictly on this. Okay, okay. Uh, didn't he say they don't do sidewalks anymore at that meeting? The Commissioner of Transportation said the state does not maintain any sidewalks and state highways except for the sidewalk on the Memorial Bridge. Yeah. And they did, and I brought up Patekawe State Park? Yes. And he says, oh, it's dread. Well, let's face it, public works, if they needed trucks to fight a fire, a uh, fire department, and the public works had one of the trucks, are we going to say, no, we're not going to do that? No, we send a truck. And I think, as far as I'm concerned, if they want us to take over the sidewalks at Hampton Beach, sign the whole beach back to us and we'll take care of it. And that, that's the only way. And if, if, if people start giving away money, and we've already gave the beach away, and at the time they were supposed to do seawalls, sidewalks, and roads, and they got the packing. And a matter of fact, I think I'm not positive, but I'm pretty sure they're not supposed to put concessions on that side either and on the deal. So I'm, I think if you people really and truly love this town, you want to stay here, and I see you cut 146,000, I tried to cut 146,000 out a little while ago on drains that are going to try to clean up people's yards, wait till you get the bill on this one. Next, they won't want to paint the, side, uh, the crosswalks. Then they're not going to, I'm going to tell you something. This is a disturbing, and I think this could be a, a real case. I know. No, I mean, uh, go from there, but I'm against doing and promising anything. Yeah. And as far as the A block, I went up and got the state myself to go up there because people come out of Mitchell's That's right. That's right. and fell, fell and fell going in from the such a big hump up there. So uh, I think uh, they should do Mitchell's, and they're lucky they weren't so, but right. thank you. But thank you, Mr. Sutter. Mr. Norton.